We got a big one on the ice tonight, and along with Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski, ready to call all the action. Barkov's one of those guys that our cameras will be keeping close tabs on here tonight. His name is up on the board in the opposition's dressing room. He's a player they will key on trying to stop. And we are about set to drop the puck on this one. Puck is dropped, and we are under. Let's it go. He scores! What a goal! It's a difficult shot to beat the goaltender with because he's got his whole arm to block it, but he gets it over the blocker, up high on the stick side. Quebec's on the board first, leading 1-0. This was hard work to get on the board here. Neither team giving up a lot, but now we got one. Maybe it'll open up. This neutral zone face-off set to go, and we are back underway. With possession along the wall. Quick snap! Stopped by the goaltender. Here in the late goings of the period, 1-0 the score. Puck is dropped and he went in all alone on the breakaway! I don't know what to this Score! They score back-to-back -back goals. They stay aggressive after getting the first one. They tack another one on here. This makes the coaches look smart every time. They depend on him for offense, and he delivers James time and time again. dominated in the shot department and now they're starting to dominate in the goal department as well this is wearing a team down front quick feed down low he scores i thought they were going to run out of time here james this is a terrific time to strike here now you carry over the intermission you come out for the next period feeling really good about yourself a quick flick of the wrist, and that snapshot beats the goaltender. He's in the low slot. He doesn't have much time to think about it. No deeks. Offensive performance is still in full effect here, even in the late stages of this period. They haven't taken their foot off the gas pedal yet. They are still pushing. And he was slowed up. Hooking looks to be the call. The official's arm goes up in the air. Let's get the official decision. And the official signaling for hooking on the play. Got to move your feet here. You're chasing the play. As soon as you stop your feet, you're going to get called. Quebec sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. This is why you have meetings in the morning. You look at video of the penalty killers. You try to establish what their tendencies are going to be. Push the penalty killers into some place they're not comfortable. On the doorstep, again the denial by the goaltender. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Moves it to Larson. And now he tries to get it across to Cop. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Whoa. Scores! Putting the power in power play. Did just about everything right on that man advantage. They capitalized. in front of the net on the power play. They continually get the puck back to the front. Eventually, it goes through the goaltender and into the net. And we're going to see a swapping of the goaltenders. I would say there's some relief here. He's been ventilated tonight. Now he gets to go take a break. 
No deeks, all too aware there's no mercy rule in hockey. They continue to apply the pressure. No, they're laying a beating on these guys now. It may be time to lay back just a bit. Strowman's got the puck. Centering pass. Taken by Larson. Cautious picking up steam. Quick pass to Granlin. Back at the point, they set it up. Cannon of a shot, and he stands tall in goal. Slides the puck to Lewis. Carries it across the line. On the attack along the boards. Scores! Good things come to those that way. Yeah, finally rewarded for all the work they did around the front of the net and in the offensive zone there. And finally able to punch through. I'm not sure how that got into the net. That thing's bouncing all over the place. Not even really a shot, but he'll take it. It's in the net now. Florida's back at center ice. They have a long way to go still here, though, Ray. Yeah, get your scores out there, James. Don't worry about the defensive end of the ice. You need goals. Puck pick. Here comes the pushback. And here we go. Yeah, this one was uh, to be expected. After the player got hurt, you would hope his teammate would jump in and try and defend them. Well, I guess that's that. That's that, and it's pretty clear, James, who had the upper hand. Man, I used to hate these blowout games if you were really on either side of it because there used to be a lot of this when the game spilled over from frustration. Late goings of this period, and we've got a 4-1 hockey game. Less than 60 seconds left here in the final frame. Referee signaling delayed penalty. Looks like hooking will be the call. There's the whistle. Let's get the official decision. Nyquist is going off for hooking. There's certain plays, as soon as they happen, the red flag goes up for the official. Stick goes across the player's waist. He's looking for hooking. The game has become better since they've cracked out on obstruction, Ray. Barkos won. Passes it to Huberto. Slides it across to Markov. And we are all over with this one tonight. That's a tough loss for them, James. I mean, they did a lot of things right. Their face-offs were good. A lot of details good. They just didn't get enough done to win. Can you see those positives after a game like this, though? Not right now. Maybe tomorrow. On behalf of Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us. Good night.